Hi, welcome back to Kathy's Corner. I'm going to start a new section in my floss tube videos called Fabulous Fun Friday Finishes. So this is my first episode of uh, finishing tutorials and I'm going to try and do them like every other Friday. And so the first one, uh, I'm going to show you how I took this finish from Stitching with the Housewives and went from just a framed piece to this piece right here. So there you go. So I'm going to show you my whole process. Come along and join me on Fridays for fabulous fun Friday finishes. Bye. I have this finish from Stitching with the Housewives. I think it's some flower of September or something like that. It was a crate, it was a calendar crate, and I only did this part. And I had it in a frame and I didn't like it. So I got this at, let's see if you can see this, see this? I got this, sorry, sorry for the bumps. I got this at, dollar store for twelve dollars so clearly it's not a dollar and this is gonna fit on there so I want to show you my process oops I'm dropping all kinds of things this is on a sticky board with <coughs> excuse me with batting so I'm just gonna hot glue this all around the edge and then I'm gonna put it on top of this piece that is half an inch wider all the way around. And so on this piece, I found this really pretty batik fabric that I've had for a long time. And I kinda of like the way that goes together. It's very fallish. So because <clears throat> I'm only using a half inch, I cut this like two and a half inches and I can just hot glue rough I don't have to sew anything I'm just gonna hot glue there because that piece is gonna go over the top of this so I'm gonna hot glue a piece on the top down the sides and around the bottom I'll show you what that looks like when I'm done I'm not gonna put batting on this one but I am going to cover the back with something because you'll be able to see the back of it from the finished piece so I'm gonna hot glue that right now turn this off So now, um, here's my piece that I got from Dollar General, and I've got magnets. I got these magnets at 
Oh, I need a light. Sorry. Let me turn the light on. Okay. There, sorry. I got these uh, magnets at Lowe's. So there they are. They come with one, two, three, four. They come like this. I think there's one. There's six. There's six in a package. So I'm going to put the magnets on this. I'm going to hot glue them. Waiting for my glue to get hot. And then I'm going to put... Here's my piece. I'm going to put washers on the back of this. This is all from uh, Stitching with the Housewives. Priscilla and Chelsea made this whole deal up. Um, my washers. Here's the washers. They come 25 in a pack at Lowe's. I'm sorry. I don't remember how much they cost. But, I mean, you know, that's a lot of projects. So, I'm using four magnets for this and four washers. So I'm gluing my magnets right now. And this is why magnets. I'm putting magnets on here so that I can swap out projects. So at Christmas time, I'll take this off. I'll make me another one. I'll measure this and save the measurements. I think I'm sure the middle, this is eight by 10. So this is nine by 11. So I have had this hot glue gun for many, many years. It is very hot. I've never burned myself badly, but I do burn myself, but not badly. They do have these little finger protectors you can get. and You know, I could probably go to the dollar store and get one of those um, oven mitts and just chop off the fingers. I could probably do that. I'm the cheapest person alive, y'all. I do everything as frugally as I can. I mean, this thing was $12, and it looks like a million bucks. So now I have to center this exactly right. I'm an eyeballer kind of person, which is awful, but I do need to mark on the back here. So here's how I'm ingeniously going to mark this. So I'm just going to stick this post-it note right there, right there. Right there. probably take me just it'd probably be just as fast to measure the thing but I don't know I got this in my head and I thought golly that sounds brilliant so I'm gonna set this down on it and then it'll tell me where to glue the washers but I have to like really make sure that I'm that I've got it kind of nicely spaced and stuff so I'm gonna put like um some flowers up here and down here so I kind of want it in the middle so we'll do it like this Now, that's where I put my washers. <laughs> okay. One, two, three, four. One. Two. Three, four, wait for that to dry. And then I'm going to get some leaves and I may, <clears throat> This is some of the batik fabric that went with this line. This is, I, I bought this a long time ago. And I think I may make some, you know how you rip the fabric and you make kind of some stringy stuff. I don't know how to explain it, but I'll show you. Like, yeah, like this. Like that. 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 So this can, this can be part of what I put with some things that, to go right up there. And I'll show you that when I'm done. But right now, I'm going to call this uh, Fully Finishing Fridays. 
So there it is. So voila. Um, let me, let me, let me I'll hold my camera up so you can kind of see it. Do you see it? Yes, you can see it. There it is. And then I'll go finish the rest of it and show you the rest of it. Okay, bye. I also found this. So um, I'm going to roll it like this. It's a wire, like wire, you know, so it looks pretty. And that, and that, and that. So I'll do that. And I'll put that here. And then have two of these kind of hanging down right here. I'll show you what it looks like when I'm done. And then somehow I'm going to put these in there too. So wait a minute till I'm done. Still videoing. I finished the bow. So I ended up putting those pieces that I ripped. I just hot glued them on there. It's very rough looking. That's fine. I'm going to put a magnet on the back of this right there. Just like I did with the other thing. And put it on the frame. And I'll show you that in a minute. These need to be pulled out some more. And I want something else to go in here. So I'm going to look around my house. I usually steal from other arrangements in my house. Do y'all do that? So I'm going to go steal from another arrangement. I'll be back. Change the whole I was doing things. I took one of those, you know, things from Walmart that has all these. I cut them all off. And then I'm just doing them together like this. Because my first try, I didn't like my first try, so this one will be better. So just wrap it tightly because they want to slip out. And I'm going to hot glue them in a minute, but so like that. Then I'm going to put the bow like this. So I'm going to hot glue that right now. Let's put some hot glue there. Hot glue that on there and just let it stay for a minute. So I like that. I like the way it looks. And I have these sunflowers, and I, I don't know what to do with them. They're so pretty, but they're really big. So, I don't want to put it there. I don't want to put it there. I don't, I, I don't know where to put them, so I may not use them. So, here's my, here's my thing. So, I'm going to put a magnet there. And I'm going to put this right there. And I'm just going to do that for now. So... Get my magnets. Put a magnet. Put a washer on this. And a magnet. On the board. So I'm going to put a magnet here so that then at Christmas time, I can, I'm going to put a magnet here. At Christmas time, I can take this off. I can take this off and redo this for Christmas. Okay. So, that's, and I did this to spur of the moment today because I'm like, I don't know. Do you get in the mood? I'm in the mood. So, hot glue that magnet there. And these things are really, really light. So, <clears throat> oh, I also have this greenery from these, um, from these sunflowers so you know I'm thinking I'm thinking I might put that somewhere so we'll see so the magnets there and the washer is gonna go here right here it'll be kind of wobbly but that's okay I don't care as long as it sticks I'm, I'm okay so I'm gonna help it So I'm going to call this Fully Finished Fun Fridays. How about that? Fully Finishing Friday Fun. Fully 
finishing Friday fun? I don't know. The Triple F Farm. Fully finishing, fully finishing fun farm. Because it's definitely the funny farm. So that's there. So there's the top part. Now, hi, it's Kathy. I just want you to know that, you know, this is my craft room and this is the way it looks on Saturdays. I have a full-time job. I'm not apologizing for it. I work well in a little bit of chaos. I'm ADHD, I work well in this. So I still have two of these sunflowers and I love sunflowers. So I'm thinking, I'm thinking maybe, maybe, you know, maybe something over here, maybe um, on this piece or on this piece in the middle. Ooh, that would be pretty. Um, I know it's, I know, you know, I'm gonna glue this on my piece, but I'm only gonna use this piece in the fall and in the spring. And then I'll dust it off. See, I made it in 2022. This is a piece where I messed up so bad on this piece. Poor, poor Chelsea and Priscilla there. Oh, bless them. You know, Chelsea's getting married, I think, next week. I bet she's going nutty. Did y'all watch their floss too this week? You can tell Chelsea's getting married. Poor thing, she has a cold. I talk about these people like I know them. I have never met them in my life. But you know how you know you meet you see people on floss tube and you think we could have a really good time. We could be good friends. Priscilla and I could be good friends. She's way younger than me. I'm just drying it. So yay. This took me, I don't know, an hour. Probably. Maybe an hour. And I just took things that I already had. Okay, wait. I don't think it's dry yet. I don't want to take my fingers off of it till it's dry. Okay. So, here it is. Um, $12 frame from Dollar General. Stuff I had, ripped fabric. That's from Walmart. I don't know where the sunflower's from. I've had it a long time. I took it off something else on my wall. So I'm really proud. And this used to be just in a frame and nobody saw it and nobody even commented on it because it just kind of, the frame kind of hit it. So now this is gonna go in my front room right next to my pumpkin table stuff and um, yay. So happy, fun, finishing Fridays, everyone. And um, see you later, bye. Oh, like and subscribe, that'd be nice. Bye.